Hey sweet friends, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. My name is Ashley and today I have some weekly laundry motivation for you. I'm starting out with a load of towels. I'm going to go ahead and throw them in the washer, get them all washed and clean. And once they are done washing, I will transfer them into the dryer and get them all dried. So this took me about six days to get all of our laundry done. And yes, that seems like a very long time and it did take a very long time. It was a very long process to get all this laundry done. We did um, all of the loads of laundry, like Jacob and Jeremiah's clothes, Madison's clothes, Ryder's clothes, mine and Nick's clothes, as well as all of the bedding throughout the house too. Me and the kids ended up getting sick this week, and so I just needed to make sure everything was clean and set it, sanitized, especially their bedding. So Jeremiah came down with the flu, and then he passed it to Jacob, then which passed it to me, and then um, Ryder ended up getting a little sick, but he wasn't, it wasn't like as bad as everyone else, so thankfully it didn't last long for him. Madison bypassed it. She's very lucky. And Nick was out of town this week, so he ended up not getting sick, thankfully. So when he came home, he was able to kind of help and take care of me because I got it towards the end of the week. So I needed to just relax on the weekend because it was miserable, to be honest. And then not only that, my back was killing me as well for some reason. So my back was hurting on top of being sick. So it just took me a while to get all of the cleaning and laundry done, plus taking care of Jacob and Jeremiah because they were pretty sick and miserable as well. So like I said, it took me six days to get all of our laundry done, but it was a whole lot of laundry. So I hope this video gives you some motivation to get everything done around your house, especially if you have some laundry you need to get done or some cleaning you need to get done. If you do have some laundry, why don't you go ahead and grab that load and let's get to washing, drying, and folding together. Like I always say, there's no better way to tackle some laundry than tackling it with a friend. And I really hope I can be that friend for you today. If you don't have any laundry, then maybe you have some cleaning you would like to get checked off your list. Go ahead and grab that list and let's get to cleaning and hopefully I can give you motivation to get that list checked off as well. As a young girl, it feels we're mine. We played hide and seek for hours, raised our shadows among the pines. So offshore, playful and free, without a care in the world. I was one rich little girl, daydreamer, kidnap me, take me back all the way back.
So this is day three of laundry motivation and all I was able to accomplish on day three was all of Madison's clothes. She had so many dirty clothes that it took me two loads to get them washed and dried and clean and then I just placed everything in her room for her to fold and put away like always. And then on day four, I'm starting off with a load of writer's clothes. I'm going to go ahead and get them all washed and clean. Once they are done, I will go ahead and wash Jacob and Jeremiah's clothes while writer's clothes are drying. And then once all of the boys' clothes are done and washed and clean, I am going to go ahead and wash Jacob and Jeremiah's bedding just because they are feeling better at this point now. So I wanted to go ahead and wash their sheets and get them all clean and their pillows and blankets and everything. So that's what I'm going to accomplish on day four and then we will move on to day five of laundry motivation. So I just realized that this is my first video for 2024. Happy New Year. I hope you and your family had an amazing New Year. We did. We just stayed home and relaxed and enjoyed family time together. We watched a movie and it was just definitely what we needed and very enjoyable. And I hope it was the same for you and your family. Do you have any big plans for 2024? Um, I would love to hear about them. If you do, please leave a comment down below letting me know. We, um, we really don't. I mean, our kids keep us super busy, so we'll have, you know, baseball and dance and everything. And I'm so excited to see Madison's new solo hit the stage. I'm super excited about it. It's so beautiful, and I just can't wait to see it. Um, and then... Really, our house, um, as you guys might know from previous videos, it is on the market. We are trying to sell it at this time, but come February, if it has not sold, we are going to take it off the market and maybe put it back on the market um, later in the year and just see what happens. It's just not really a great time right now to sell or to really buy. Um, we were just trying to see what would happen and it's just not in God's plan for our family right now potentially to move and if it is then it will happen and if um, it doesn't that's okay we will wait it out and see what his plan is and for you know the right time and everything so um, but other than that I mean no we you know it's Madison's freshman year of high school which is crazy that the first semester has already flown by and she just started her second semester. Um, Jacob's in eighth grade and it's flying by and Jeremiah's in seventh and that's flying by. So other than the kids just, you know, growing up super fast and keeping us very busy, we don't really have any major plans planned for 2024, but um, we'll just see what happens. But like I said, I would love to know if you guys have any big plans. So definitely let me know down below in the comments. you close maybe hold your hand a little while somehow i know you're gonna be the girl that i'll end up calling my own we ride around in style sleeves rolled up glasses on and then you make that smile and my heart starts racing when i'm with you
So on this day, I started off by washing mine and Nick's bedding again. I know that I already washed our bedding on day like two, I believe, in this video. But since I was sick, I wanted to rewash them once I started feeling better. Um, this was the week that I was going to wash bedding to begin with. So it kind of just worked out and I started off with my bedding because no one was sick at that time. And then that's when everyone ended up getting sick. So I wanted to go ahead and rewash our bedding since I was feeling better at this point. And then that's why you also saw me wash Madison's bedding on this day, even though she wasn't sick, but it was just the week to wash bedding. So I wanted to go ahead and get her, um, bedding cleaned and everything as well. And then I am washing the boys clothes again. Um, I know that I already washed their clothes once this week, but since they were sick, I wanted to go ahead and wash all of their clothes that they were wearing while they were sick and get them all clean and sanitized as well. And no, this isn't everything that they wore while they were sick, but it is a few of their pieces of clothing that they wore while they were sick. So I wanted to go ahead and wash all of them and get them cleaned. And then now I am moving on to mine and Nick's clothes. I'm going to go ahead and throw them in the washer and get them washed while Jacob and Jeremiah's clothes are drying.
So now we have finally reached the last day of laundry motivation for the week. I'm in mine and Nick's room and I'm folding all of our laundry. I am hanging up all of our shirts and then once I am done hanging up everything and folding everything and putting it away, I'm going to move on to Ryder's clothes and I'm going to do the same. I'm going to hang up all of his shirts, fold all of his laundry, and then put everything away. And then that's going to be it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed hanging out with me and I hope I was able to give you some motivation to get up and get some laundry done, get some cleaning done, whatever it might have been. I hope I gave you all the motivation you needed to get it done. If I was able to do so, please let me know by liking this video. It really does help my channel out as well. Definitely leave a comment down below. I love chatting and getting to know each and every one of you. And then my goal for 2024 is to have two videos up a week for you. Um, right now, I only have one laundry video a week, and it's just very hard to have two laundry videos a week. I know that you guys really enjoy my laundry motivation, but it's super hard to have two laundry videos a week unless I take a week off and film a lot during that week and then get ahead. So um, I might either do that or I've thought about doing laundry and cleaning again. I know my cleaning videos don't do too well, but I enjoy cleaning and I enjoy editing and posting those videos. So I thought about either doing that or also like a Sunday reset. So let me know down in the comments what your um, thoughts are on any of that and what you would like to see more of. Um, but as of right now, I will have one video this week and I'll try to get another one up two um and then as far as the days i'm going to be posting it's probably still going to be like tuesday thursday or maybe um a sunday depending on if i do the reset so um i will let you know on that um you can also let me know down below in the comments what days you prefer for me to post on i would love to hear what you guys um would like and what your thoughts and your opinions are but either way definitely come back for some more laundry motivation and potentially cleaning motivation and as always, thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to hang out with me. It truly does mean the world. I don't say this enough, but I really do appreciate all the time that you take to watch my videos, to leave comments, to like them, whatever it is that you take the time out of your day to do to support me and my family and my channel. It truly does mean so much to me. I hope you all have an amazing day. And as always, thank you again for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye friends. Every time we touch our feet